Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and cheap coins, check out instantmudcoins.com and use code ZERK for 20% off. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zerks coming at you today with another YouTube video and today we've got a double golden ticket gameplay and we've got James Morgan and tight end Robert Woods which as you guys know James Morgan was actually made by Throne because it looks like Throne. The bad YouTuber Throne looks just like him. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Greg Stanaway for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the mid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel, turn notification bell on, and comment down below, Nota Gang. And guys, make sure you guys check out my morning video because we got lucky and we pulled a GT. Day one. Last year took me like three months. Yes, we have got Golden Ticket thrown on the team. Now, with this card, it's a great pocket passing QB. You guys can see 99 throw power, 98 short, 99 medium, 99 deep, 99 throw under pressure, 99 throw on the run, 99 play action, and he's got 87 speed with 93 XL, of course, with Sprinter. I guess, like, the best thing to put on him would be, like, the West Coast, probably, because you get short and medium accuracy, so you can get him to, like, 99 short, 99 medium, and also add the 99 deep because he has it based there, so that's probably the move, but I run play fake on him, so is what it is there. Now, in terms of actually running with this card, he's not that good. 82 carry. 60 juke you know 75 change direction he's not supposed to be someone like an rg3 or a tebow card that's coming out this is really just a main pocket passing qb that can scramble if you need to but the thing is he's actually tied for the fast release him and rg3 have the same release they're both the fastest i think rg3 is probably the better card because he can actually you know juke and stuff like that but wanted to do throne today of course he's got omaha we also have hara master for 2 ap inside dead eye for 1 ap conductor for 1 ap gunslinger for 2 ap and escape artist for 2 ap so yes you get escape artist gunslinger conductor inside dead eye and hara master for 8 ap rg3 can get the same thing tim tebow will also be to get the same thing all these abilities same ap so that is golden ticket thrown but then we also have got golden ticket tight end robert woods now i was really surprised how cheap this card is because i feel like he is potentially the best gt today i know that you know rg3 is really good so he's going to be more expensive as a quarterback but robert woods is nasty i mean and i got him for like 550k i want to say i bought him for he's 97 speed and 97 excel at tight end with 99 short 99 medium 99 run block he's also got 98 catching traffic 73 strength 99 catching 95 jumping he's six feet tall and he's also got 96 impact block but then he's also got 92 juke move with 95 carrying and 89 break tackle by the way he does actually get wide receiver secondary position so if you want to put a wide receiver you can i recommend just keeping a tight end now i do want to show off his run blocking more than anything so i put vanguard on him which i have never used this ability before but it's the first time we're going to do it and also honor alignment on him so he's going to get impact block wins versus dbs if you have not seen this ability activate before and also vanguard they literally plow over dbs like just destroy them so robert woods we're gonna run the ball a little bit in today's gameplay so you guys kind of see that but also we're gonna take advantage of the mismatch that having a 97 speed tight end brings to you let's get into it Looking to take your game in Madden 21 to another level? Make sure to check out HotRoute.Tips. Get access to ebooks, tips, and schemes for Madden pros. Use code ZERK for 10% off. Let's dominate Weekend League. So that is going to be my opponent's top three. Looks like, you know, he's got a couple of Cowboys over there, but they actually have the Giants cam on them. All right, so we're starting off in the defensive side of things. Unfortunately, you know, I wish we start off in offense, but it is what it is. It does look like a Giants theme team. I mean, literally every player right here in offense either is a giant or has giants chem because obviously Dak is not a giant he's gonna try to throw deep on me and Kenny Galladay just got open deep all right so we got to watch out for the rollouts I know this guy is gonna try to roll out a lot here and I do have a QB contain set up you're not rolling out all right second and 19 I wonder if he knows I have a QB contain set up or whatever as he does try to roll out here again and we got some pressure and a hit yeah I refuse to let somebody roll out on me and end up just picking up big time chunk plays by doing that so once again 
QB contain going up, hopefully get some pressure elsewhere, but we get the sack from Clowney. So fourth and 28 coming up, and he is going for this. I am shading over the top, and once again, you know, QB contain, if he wants to try to scramble outside the pocket again, I mean, go for it. It's not going to be open. None of his routes are open. We get a sack. Chase Young coming in there with the big time play, but now let's see what we can do. We do have James Morgan. We got Robert Woods, and we're going to have Woods open on that corner. Robert Woods, great, great catch. So now we're going to go to a run to Robert Woods' side, so you guys can just kind of see how he does run block as he got a pretty good block right there. Reggie Bush, not enough speed. All right, once again, we're going back to the run game, this time to the left side, and again, you guys can see, you know, we've got Woods out there holding a block, and and Reggie Bush hits the edge and gets the TD. So you guys saw right there, Robert Woods, great run blocking on the edge there is, oh, I definitely messed up. I could have that tackle there. So I wonder if now he's just gonna try to run the ball out here, and it looks like he may attempt to do just that. So he's gonna try to run the ball a little bit and try to not get sacked. Second and three. Is he running again? No, he's actually flipping his entire offense here. I do have a QB contain set up, so... Just because I didn't spread my D-line does not mean I do not have a QB contain set up. Second and three. I'm going to jump the flats, though, and look out for that. That's not going to be open. Yep, nothing open. Down the field. Badger could add a pick. Third and three. Let's see if he decides to run the ball again. I think we should be able to shut this down if he does try to. Is he going to try to run it? No, he's definitely passing. Definitely passing here. And I'm going to jump to the flats again and just cover on Shockey because it's not going to be open and we get a sack. All right, fourth and 11. He's definitely going to go for this here and he is flipping his entire offense once again. I'm not going to guard on Shockey because if he wants to throw the flats, he can definitely throw the flats. It does not matter to me. I'm going to guard that rollout corner though and I knew he was going to get that open across the middle. Got to be able to stop his rollouts there. I did have a QB contain set up. They just didn't work. All right, third and four here. Once again, you know, we have that QB contain set up. So hopefully we can shut him down from rolling out of the pocket. But we, we got to get some pressure on. I actually might do something here. I might come screaming around this edge and it looks like the flats. I accidentally just hit Y. I'm going to go for the sack and he gets open down the field. And he caught that. So now Dak is actually activated and he is going to run the ball. Good tackles. Once again, he might try to run the ball here. I'm not going to run commit because if he passes, it'd be like an instant TD. And it looks like it is actually going to be a run. Good tackle again. All right, third and goal. I'm going to run commit here. I feel like he's probably going to try a run again three times in a row. And he did run it again. And again, we stopped him. All right, fourth and goal. I am run committing here. Please, defense, get the stop on him. And he's going to a stretch to the outside. No, Dion got blocked. And surprisingly enough, he's actually going for this. And he has a Lynn Bowden in a QB. So wasn't exactly sure what to expect, but we shut that down. All right, so we tried to go for two. Not really sure why, but he tried to go for two. Did not work out there. And we're going to have Reggie Bush open over the middle. And what was that? Did we get pressured or something? I don't even think that we got pressured there. The, the pass literally just went right over Reggie. Like, it was just a bad pass. Why? Why, why was that a bad pass there? And it even said Deadeye. So that makes zero sense as to why that pass was just sailed there but uh okay i'm gonna come in for this sack though and try to force him to throw it and he didn't catch it all right well he's down to the 29 and i'm not really sure why our golden ticket quarterback you know missed that throw but very unfortunate third and 11 though i'm trying a little bit of a different setup to stop him here we have a spy we have somebody out in the flats and i'm gonna watch this but again i knew he was gonna go over the middle there no one could stop it i feel like this is gonna be a run down at the seven right yep and it is gonna be a run play someone get there and get the tackle good hit jamal it's probably gonna be another run and it looks like yep another run play and he gets for the td again so i gotta say i'm definitely really really disappointed that we we ended up throwing a pick there i, I still don't understand it but he gets touchdown out of it, and he's going for two here. I'm going to look out for that right there. He might try to take off. No way. Okay, incomplete. All right, so it's fourth and 22 with 27 seconds left here, and I know if I turn the ball over, he's going to get three points out of this at least. I don't care. It's a Robert Woods gameplay. You guys want to see Robert Woods, and we're going to force the ball into Robert Woods and see if we can make the catch, and... Maybe I should have rack caught it, I guess. Maybe aggressive wasn't the move there. So it definitely was open, but if I possession catch that, I don't get the first down there. So I tried to go for the aggressive, hoping he'd somehow get the first down. 
Ugh, not a very good first half here for James Morgan and Robert Woods. I mean, some good run blocks out of Woods, but not much in the receiving game as he's going to be open to the flats. Jamal need a big hit, man. We got to be able to get a stop here. Maybe if we get lucky, we'll get like a turnover or something. Once again, I'm going to shoot down to the flats. I'm going to come around though, and we get the sack. Really just wanted to try to keep him in the pocket because he really only makes big plays once he gets out of the pocket here. He might be trying to go to like a crosser or something though. We'll see what he's got planned. He's definitely got a pass here, though, and try to get out of bounds. So I'll let him have that over the middle. We get the sack, and he's not going to get any points out of this. Right, so at least we do start off the second half with the ball. And, of course, we're going to go to the run game here. Robert Woods, good blocks, and he even moved on to get another block there. All right, second and six. We're going to pass the ball. I want to try to get the ball to Robert Woods for you guys, but he's just really not getting open. Reggie Bush, though, open in the flats. And we have just got a terrible stat line right now for James Morgan. We have, like, two completions, 20 yards, and a pick. So it is definitely not going too good, but we got... Got Waller open here and he got the first. All right, third and 10. Let's see if we can get Woods open here to the corner, which it looks like he's not going to be. We could probably fit that. What? What's up with the camera angle there? I really don't know what was up with the camera angle there, but fourth and eight. Again, you guys already know. I'm looking to go to Woods, which he's going to be open here because it's one on one man coverage and that's not going to work out for Jabril Peppers who catches us so finally a good play there to robert woods down to the 16 again i'm looking to go back to him here and i think we could probably fit it in yep good catch there and now once again we're going back to the run game here down in the goal line second and three woods can you get a nice block and he kind of does there oh we just couldn't break free all right third and four i am gonna run it to the outside here for some reason we didn't block drc but still got the first all right fourth and goal this is gonna be the final play of the third quarter here and i just forced it into robert woods he caught it but no td man i'm playing terrible man this has really really not been the best gameplay so far for james morgan i'll definitely admit to that not playing the greatest but I got the user pick. All right, so we made up for it immediately. I was definitely ready for that. Now, two-point conversion, though. Uh, why is going to be... Oh, my God, I just pressed the wrong button. I just pressed the wrong button. So that is just terrible. And then we have to get another stop. And I obviously want to try to throw the ball deep for you guys with James so I can show off the animation. We got to get the ball back, though. On third and nine, let's see if we can get it done here. I'm going to watch out for this corner. I'm actually going to, like, watch the corner, but come back across the middle because I know he wants to throw this route right here. And instead, he still threw it in Badger. You're supposed to be there. All right, so we're up by one, but he's in field goal range here. So we have to get a stop. Please do not let him get a TD. We kind of have to stop him here because the, the time is definitely going to be an issue. And actually, I'm okay with him getting into the end zone, which he didn't. So now the timing is definitely going to be a big issue. Only a minute and 20 seconds left here, and he got in. So I'm actually okay with this. All right, golden ticket thrown is going to have to lead us to victory here. But let's see my opponent does. He runs a QB power with Dak, and he didn't... What? He got in? I cannot believe he actually got in there because I hit him like two yards behind the goal line. I guess he just fell forward. Man, that is super, super tough. But Robert Woods is open on the sideline. Great catch, Woods. Robert Woods making plays out here, but we are down to the 41-yard line, and we have X wide open underneath. Julio Jones catch that and uh, try to get a bounce. All right, so once again, might be looking to go to Julio here. And oh, he just ran, come in. Julio Jones wide open for the TD. Okay, so I'm not going to go for two. I'm going to try to take this into overtime, but also my opponent has got three timeouts here with 29 seconds, so... We might be able to get a stop or a pick or something. Now is the time I need the defense to show up here. We got to at least take this into overtime. I am sending a blitz off that right side, though. Brian Poole is going to be blitzing here. We just cannot get beat deep down the field, as I'll, I'll give him that, I guess. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drop a lot of players back into coverage here. So I'm going to be guarding, like, all the flats, everything like that. We're going to have a QB spy. I will allow him to roll out, but I'm just not going to let him throw the ball deep down the field. So I'm going to look out for Shepard, and if he tries to throw like that, you know, middle route that he does the in route from the far right side i guess i'll just have to kind of allow it because apparently my players do not like playing on that as that's not gonna be open come back across the middle no he's going down the field reed thank you justin reed big game saving play there honestly that came in really really bad now i'm gonna jump out here immediately to the left side and maybe try to jump this flat route if that's what he's gonna go to 
but I feel like he's completely changing up the play here. Is he changing up the play a lot? Yup, he is definitely changing up a lot. I'm gonna look out for that though. No, I can't get there with Cam and he caught it. All right, I really don't have a choice here. I have to blitz on this play. We've got to get some pressure on him. We absolutely have got to get like a hit on him, a sack or something. I'm gonna try to bump into Sterling Shepard here or something or watch out for that over the middle. He's throwing it deep down the field. Deion Sanders with the INT. And Deion, Deion, return this. Return it, Deion, no. He tried to chuck up a deep ball and it did not work out there so we only have five seconds left we are probably gonna go into overtime here but if i can get this ball to robert woods and try to like activate him a little bit and get something to go for his x factor robert woods okay all right so this has definitely been a bit of a struggle for us out here offensively i mean really the only mistake we had was an overthrown ball by golden ticket taylor throne so thank you very much, Throne, as he's running the ball here. No! Herschel Walker, first run of overtime is going to be down in field goal range, basically. Man, you have got to be kidding me, man. If I go to OT to lose like this, oh, this is going to be so sad. He is flipping everybody. I'm going to put a flat out there. And again, you got a QB contained for sure. Try to keep him in the pocket. He is going to pass the ball. I'm going to come back across the middle. You better be able to guard that. You better guard that, Honey Badger. What are you doing? I have a QB contained set up and everything, but we just can't seem to keep him in the pocket somehow. I mean, I'm literally QB containing. Good hit. Give me a fumble. How is that not a fumble right there, man? That has to be a fumble. Down to the seven. I'm expecting a stretch, and it is a stretch. Get out there. Someone make the tackle read. That's how we lose the game. That is how we lose the game. So I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I kind of feel like we got cheated in this game. Did I play amazing? No, but also, I don't know why we threw a pick. I wasn't under pressure. It was wide open. I have inside dead eye as well. And the ball was just completely sailed over Reggie Bush. It was an interception. His release is pretty solid. And I mean, you guys saw Robert Woods, five catch, 108 yards. He definitely is a beast of a tight end. Like insane run blocking. Dig into the end zone and touchdown. I am so mad that we lost this game, but it did showcase, you know, enough of Robert Woods and also James Morgan. I told you guys, I'll post losses. I don't care. I lose games. I lose a lot of games. Everybody loses games. I do not care. I will post losses if it was good enough gameplay and it showcased the player enough. Maybe James Morgan, there's something wrong with the card because I don't know why he overthrew that pass. Just kind of unfortunate there. And I feel like we got a little bit screwed by EA. Not gonna lie, but I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure you guys drop a like the video, and of course hit that sub button down below. It is what it is. Love Robert Woods, although we didn't have the absolute craziest game with him, just really couldn't get the ball to him as much as I wanted to. And Morgan, I don't know why he had the bad pass. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.